In this video, we will demonstrate how to protect Kaspersky Endpoint Security and Kaspersky Network Agent from end users. To prevent the users from disabling the protection, prohibit managing Kaspersky Endpoint Security and Network Agent without a password. The default settings provide the users with at least three methods to disable the protection. Uninstall Kaspersky Endpoint Security, which requires administrative permissions. However, some users may have them, especially on laptops. Uninstall the network agent. Some 10 to 20 minutes after the network agent is removed, Kaspersky Endpoint Security will no longer be controlled by the policy and the user will be able to change any setting. There is password protection for the network agents, but it is not enabled by default. Close Kaspersky Endpoint Security, click exit on the shortcut menu of the product icon in the notification area. This action doesn't even ask for elevated permissions, any user can do this. Let's make sure of that. Exit Kaspersky Endpoint Security using the shortcut menu of its icon. Note that the Kaspersky Endpoint Security policy cannot prevent this by default. A computer where protection is off is an issue, because it may easily get infected. It is often considerably more difficult to neutralize an infection than to prevent it. Disabled protection is one of the conditions that give a computer the critical status. In the administration console, information about such computers is displayed in the administration server node, on the monitoring tab. The issue description includes the number of computers where protection is disabled. Open the selection of problem computers. Double-click the Tom laptop computer to open its properties. If the protection application is disabled by the user rather than malfunctions, you can go to the Applications section and start Kaspersky Endpoint Security. The command will be carried out only on the computer whose properties you are working with. You cannot start the application on all computers within a group or selection in a couple of clicks. Close the computer properties and return to the monitoring tab of the administration server node. The pie chart of device status has turned green. Starting Kaspersky Endpoint Security does not solve the issue in general, because the users can disable protection again. To deprive them of this capability, you need to protect Kaspersky Endpoint Security with a password, which you can set in the policy. The advantage of password protection is that it remains active even when the policy is disabled. Once the password protection settings are applied to Kaspersky Endpoint Security, the users will be unable to manage the product without a valid password even if the administrator disables the policy. Save the settings in the policy. Let us try to exit Kaspersky Endpoint Security on the user's computer. The user cannot exit the protection application now, because this action requires entering the password. Try to uninstall Kaspersky Endpoint Security. Note that the uninstall button appears dimmed. Kaspersky Endpoint Security is protected with a password, but if the user possesses administrator permissions, he or she can uninstall Network Agent, and thus disrupt computer management. The Network Agent is less likely to be noticed by the local user than Kaspersky Endpoint Security. The list of installed programs is one of the few places where it can be found. Let us protect the Network Agent with a password. Switch to the Settings section. Enable password protection, select the use uninstall password checkbox. Make the use uninstall password setting required close the respective lock. Save the settings in the policy. Wait for the policy to be applied. Let us try to uninstall the Kaspersky Security Center network agent from the user's computer. You can see that after the policy has been applied, the user cannot uninstall network agent without entering the password. We have enabled password protection for Kaspersky Endpoint Security and Network Agent. Now the users cannot uninstall Kaspersky Lab applications, exit Kaspersky Endpoint Security, or stop protection. You can hide the fact that Kaspersky Endpoint Security is installed on the computer from the users. 
For example, select not to display the KESS icon in the notification area. This setting is available in the interface section of the Kaspersky Endpoint Security Policy.